Okay guys, every angler's pride and joy is tackle box. And I think you've just had a, a quick look at uh, my tackle box. Uh, okay, this, this box is uh, probably about 15 years old and uh, it's got a couple of battle scars uh, that's uh, happened through the years. But um, all in all, it all depends on how well you take care of your equipment. Uh, this has been painted, varnished a couple of times, as well as the layout has been changed um, three times now to suit me individually. Okay, um, while we're at the bottom, um, as I say, different strokes for different folks, and um, that's what I believe. Um, these are ball dip bottles, and I think there's a lot of anglers that have moved away from this. But I still fish with it, and for the reason of it being 100 mils, as well as uh, being easier and faster to use on um, the flavor combinations or the flavors that I use the most often. Okay, and then other compulsory items that you should have in your tackle box. Marking pens, right, I've got uh, different colors, red, black, and blue. And the reason for the different colors are for marking out lines at specific distances. So simply by using three different uh, markers, I'm able to fish on a spot at three different distances. Okay, um, spools, uh, like I've explained in a previous video, uh, 6,000 reels. Then I have uh, my 5,000 spools. And uh, then I've just got um, 